Hello everyone, welcome to 2D Board Gamers. My name is Dave, and today we're going to continue my pool aspect series. This time it's Ghost Spider versus Loki. Uh, Gamora didn't have much luck against Loki. We'll see if Ghost Spider can do any better. Um, well, let's take a look at the deck. So it's a pretty big deck. Um, first of all, we've got her sick Ghost Spider Signature 15, of course. And I went really heavy on the Web Warriors, hoping that I can work with that. Uh, so we got Scarlet Spider. We got SBDR Spider, however you want to say it. Spider Ham. Spider-Man Hobby. Spider-Man Miles. Spider-Man Otto. And Spider-Man Peter. And of course, across the Spider-Verse. And then since Ghost Spider likes cards that are interrupts or responses, we got three copies of Warning. And we got Young Love. And then we've got three double resources. The two, the power of all of us. Crew quarters, helicarrier, team building exercise since we have so many web warriors, downtime, and endurance. And then for the pool aspects, we got three copies of barely a scratch because that's an interrupt. Good old cut upper. I know a couple of the Lokis have stalwart, but not all of them. Uh, get in front of me. Not my responsibility. A pool of resources. And we've got get good. Since I lost as Gamora, this will be free. Healing factor. And... Stick to the miss. All right. Let's web sling to the table and see how it goes. Okay, we're at the table. Uh, he's got 20 health. Uh, we got to defeat three Lokis. We got the Time Stone with the War of Asgard, which is acceleration. One, two, three, four, five, six. See what my opening hand is. Strength is good. Power of all of us. Auto. Alright, so between boarding for one, five, one. That's good. I could take care of the War of Asgard at least. Um, I'll mulligan those two cards. Spider Ham and Parental Guidance. I could get George Stacy. That's not a bad idea. We will do that. Okay. So before I go down, parental guidance, I will search for George. There he is. I think he goes in my hand. Yeah. Guidance. Okay, so we're going to use Spider Ham for George. We're going to flip. I 
do not have any technology, so Spider-Man Auto is just there. I'm going to do a Phantom. Uh, first, I'm going to port for one, standard. Port for five, and then port for one. So that's seven. So that goes away. Um, auto thwart for one to get rid of that. So all the threat is taken care of. Okay. And then either I'm defending with a cool card or I'm going to let auto take it. I'm probably going to let auto take it. Um. Uh, Yeah, this is going to be a building turn. Uh, we add a threat. So he's attacking for four. I'll have auto take it. Thank you. Discard the top four cards of my deck. Place one threat for each type. Event. 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 Ally. So that is two. counter card now is an assault okay well this is not what I wanted to do but I can still do it all right we're gonna do web binding to stop that activation all right and then we're going to spin three, get a carrier out. And I'm going to thwart for one to keep that under control a little bit. One, two, three, four, five. Add the threat back. He's attacking me for four. I'll defend for three. He does five. Two, and this is worth two. I'm going to do a ghost kick and do remove six health and ready. And then on a flip, and my encounter card now is caught off guard. I'll get rid of George, I guess. Then I'm going to do the power of all of us, cross the spider verse, search my discard pile for a web warrior. I have to exhaust myself to do that. And Peter Parker. We'll get Peter Parker. He is going to thwart for two, which readies me. And I'm going to thwart for one. No. I'm going to attack for two. One, two, three, five. We add a threat. All right. Now, he's attacking for four. I'll defend for three. Discard the top card of the Infinity Stone deck and add its boosts. So that's six. So I'm going to take three. And I'm going to pitch two cards. Phantom Flip. Oh. Yeah, well, okay. That'll ready me. And then I lose Peter. My encounter card is I am stunned. Okay. Then I'm going to use a helicarrier. Get good to get a web bracelet. I will attack to get rid of my stun. One, two, three, four, five. Mm 
Let me add a threat. He's attacking me for four. I will defend. Uh, no, I will not. Yes, I will, because I only have five health. I just can't ready. Uh, so that's five. I take two. My encounter card is. Can I just cancel that? Nope. Swap Loki with a different Loki and probably be defeated. Oh, well, maybe not if I get lucky. Okay, and it says he activates against me. No. Gotta hope. He's attacking me for two. Advance. Ooh. So I have one health left. Which means that guy's only worth one. Well, I gotta get the healing factor out. And I have to go down. Okay. Which means I'm gonna lose my web bracelet. Yep. One, two, three. Healing factor. Crew quarters. Spin down. Use my crew quarters. One, two, three, four, five, six. He adds a threat. He's scheming for a lot. Four, six. He heals three. So he's back up to 15. And he gets an extra boost. And my encounter card is Shuffle the Infinity, Discard Pile. So I lose a turn of no stone, which stinks, but there are far worse in ca um, cards in that deck. Let's discard top four to add threat. Okay, so do I have my thwarting? I do not. Oh, that's bad. Um, that is really bad. So Hobby can thwart for two, which is actually better than my stick to it this. So we're going to give myself some endurance and use the three quarters. Um, we're going to shuffle Ticket to the Multiverse back into my deck because I pretty sure I used it. Yeah. And then I have to come up. Uh, I have sustained four, so this is worth two now. Two, three, we'll get hob I'm gonna use that. We'll get hobby out. And hobby's gonna thwart for two. Let's get that die out of the way. And okay. Holding on barely. Oops. Ready. We add a threat. He's attacking for a lot. I'm going to have to use Spider Man Hobby. Wow, that is eight. 
and discard the top four cards of my deck, which I could still lose here, right? Event, support, upgrade, events. We had three. So my encounter card is Worried Father. Uh, George and set him aside under this attach this obligation to him. He should be in my discard pile, I think. Yeah. Exhaust Gwen Stacy to remove this. Add George to my hand. Okay. Do I have a thwarting? I do. Okay. First of all, regeneration kicks in. So I am... No, I'm down three because of the pain endurance. Okay. We're going to thwart for one. Thwart for five. Readies me. Draws a card. Um, one. Two. And we'll get stick to it of this out. And I'm going to attack for two. One. Add a threat. He's attacking me for two. I will defend for three. This so I take nothing, but I'm going to one, two, deal six damage to him with the ghost kick, which will ready me, draw a card, which will give me an encounter card. Flip this guy over, which is the healing. Okay. And I get an extra encounter card. All right. So first encounter card is seduced. I cannot stop that. Second encounter card is. I am stunned. If I was already stunned, take two damage. Um, so I could stop that and I would do three damage to him. That sounds like a good idea. Especially since I cannot attack right now because I am seduced. So yes, let's do that. So he takes three to stop devious sorcery. I am completely out of cards. All right, so first healing factor kicks in. And then I will thwart for one. And he thwarts for a lot. He schemes for a lot. We are down to four. That'll go up to eight. We have no minions. It's seen, I am full health-wise. I can either exhaust and George will come into my hand. Ticket to the multiverse has already been shuffled, unfortunately. No resources to spend to get rid of seduced, but I'm useless with the seduced on. 
So I am going to flip to Gwyn and I'm going to exhaust her, remove this from the game, and I get George in my hand. And we'll use the helicarrier to play him. Okay. And I gotta hope I get an energy mental. One, two, three, four, five, six, energy mental. Yes, although very expensive energy mental, because I energy is energy. Ouch. Alright, we had a threat. He schemes for a base four. Six. So that goes up to eleven. Wow. And then he's going to heal three. So he's back up to seven. And get a boost. And my encounter card is Caskets of Ancient Winters, which has got five threat. And an Amplify. And how is my thwarting? Garbage. All right. Energy. And a mental. We'll get rid of the seduced. I am currently full. I don't have ticket to the multiverse. I'm going to flip. Um, I need to stop his activation. Stop his activation. And it's an action. I can exhaust and attach one event from my hand. I'm going to attach barely a scratch on there. Why am I exhausted? I didn't have to exhaust to get rid of that. No. I'm not sure why I'm exhausted. I will thwart for one. I need to stop an activation and I also need to thwart. Oh, I don't have to stop the activation. I need to thwart. So let's pitch those two cards while you have a good chance of thwarting. One, two, three, four, five. Five. I did not get my thwart. Oh, that stinks. I was really hoping. All right, we add a threat. I'm going to defend. He's attacking me for a base three. I'm defending for three. Four, five. He gets an additional one and a tough. So he's seven, so I'm gonna take four. I mean, barely a scratch, there's only one symbol, so I get to stop, oh, I get to stop one of it. I'm gonna get to ready and draw a card. My counter card is that I'm stopping. Um, I have sustained four. So this is worth two. I am canceling that win revealed and do three damage, which will just knock off the stuff. But that stops Crisis on Infinite Deadpools. Um, okay. I lost as Gamora, so get good is free. Pallet Carrier. Plus, Ticket of the Multiverse. 
gets Peter Parker. I am going to thwart for one, and he's going to thwart for two. And I really, oh, and my regeneration kicks in. I really need a thwarter. Big time, please. One, two, three, four, five. There we go, Phantom Flip. That's what I was waiting for. Okay. We add a threat. He's attacking me for two. I will defend for three. Just two. I'm going to do a Phantom Flip, which I remove five threat. I get to ready, draw a card. And then I am stunned. My encounter card is Master Plan. Can I stop that? No. Okay. Then I am going to thwart for one off of the main. And I'm going to use the helicarrier and a not my responsibility. Oh, I could have stopped that master plan. I could do four damage. Yeah, that's okay. All right, helicarrier, I'm going to do a ghost kick. Did I? I don't know if I did. Okay. I just realized I can't do a ghost kick because I'm stunned. Um, that is frustrating. If I could take my thwart back to get rid of the stun, which I guess I'll do. I'll get rid of the stun. But I didn't do a basic ability, so I don't get to do that then. Well, that stinks. Um, okay, well, we'll use the helicarrier for downtime. And... I'm going to put a not my responsibility under George, I think. Oh, no. We could do it this way. So let's not do the downtime. We use a warning for stick to itiveness, which we're ready. Then I will thwart for one. Then I'll do the ghost kick for six, which brings him down to one. And I don't think I want to play with a side scheme yet. Um, and then Peter Parker will thwart for two. Okay, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five. He is, Loki is stalwart. Okay, uh, we add a threat. I'm going to be stunned again. How did I get stunned the first time? Um, I need to go back and check and see if I forgot to move the power. All right, I uh, went back and looked, and apparently I forgot to remove the Power Stone, so I kind of did a little things out of my way to avoid a stun that I shouldn't have had, but oh well. Uh, we add a threat, and 
then he is going to attack me. I'm going to have Spider-Man take it. Okay. Reality Stone. My encounter card is... Okay, I am frozen. So that's going to stink a bit, but... Okay. One. Two. Three. Nope. Let's try that again. We are going to attack, defeat this first Loki. All right. Let's see what Loki we get. Uh, no, there's only four. Come on. Thank you. Number two. So we get this Loki, who has his attacks gain piercing. Put these other guys back. All right, I cannot ready. I need. Alter Ego Action, Energy Strength. Okay. Well, we're not going to worry about that right now. One, two, three. We're going to do a Cut Upper, which will do five damage and stun. is a wild but I can't ready because of the frozen so it doesn't matter um he is stunned this turn so I need an energy strength okay so one two three one two three four five okay we can do it it's annoying because I do have to go down to do it, though. So. All right, we had a threat. He is stunned. My encounter card is the Enchantress, who seduces me. Is there a seduce in here? Nope. Okay. play attacks and I have two attachments I need to get rid of now in Alter Ego and I need an energy mental okay I'm literally tra trashing my entire hand to do this oh that stinks okay well guess it's got to be done I'm gonna flip down uh, ticket to the multiverse can get shuffled in because I think I used it. Yep, so there's that at least. All right, energy strength and energy mental. Um, we'll do this as energy strength. And we'll do that as energy mental. All right. And at least he thwarts for very little. One, two, three, four, five. And I got my other web bracelets in my hand. Two, three, four, five, six. But I get to spin the turn where he adds a lot of threat. All right. So first we add one. Then he's schemes for three four he is not attacking so that doesn't matter so this goes up to seven and then i have to discard an upgrade 
Um, I'm going to discard the crew quarters, I think. My encounter card is Loki's Crown. After I make a basic attack, I can spend a mental strength. Mental strength. I don't know if I care. All right, we're going to flip. We need to pitch two cards. Or, well, one card. We're going to do a helicarrier and a card. Uh, team building, I guess. For a web bracelet. Then five threat. And five, six damage. Well, threat is a little scarier right now. And I'm not going to be able to play both cards. No. Probably not. Unless I draw a double resource. Alright, I am going to thwart for one. And then I'm going to do a phantom flip. Where I remove five threat. Which will ready me. Draw a card. Come on. Give me a double resource. Nope. But I can use George. And I'm going to do six damage. So that knocks him down to nine. And draw a card. Oh, they may be played as if they were from my hand. Okay. Um, that will cancel his attack. Yeah, let's put the web binding. I think I forgot to do the healing factor. All right, we're ready. Um, we got a threat. He's attacking me for a base three. I will defend. Attach this card to Loki. Okay, so I take nothing, but I'm going to spend... I can't do that. Two cards. Phantom Flip. I'm going to remove five threat from Casket of Winters, I think. So it removes five threat from a scheme. I ready. And I draw a card. Take it to the multiverse. Nice. Okay. And then we flip this guy over. My encounter card is Unnatural Storms. And I exhaust any ally. I don't have any allies. And no, oh, she should have hit me for one. Okay. Don't have a lot left to do. So we're going to take it to Multiverse, Parental Guidance, get Spider Ham out. Spider Ham is going to thwart for two to get rid of the unusual storm. And then his power is after he attacks or thwart, discard the top card, he takes damage equal to the number of boost icons. So he takes four damage. So he is gone. But so is Luffy. So I'm okay with that. Uh, we got four on Casket of Ancient Winters, four on the main. Loki's got nine. Okay. That is... I'm going to hit the Enchantress for two? You know, I don't care about her. She, 
I'm going to hit Loki for two. I'm getting ready. One, two. I'm going to deck. Three, four, five. Ooh, a ghost kick. Nice. Okay. We add a threat. He's attacking me for a base three, four, base five. I will defend for three. He gets an additional boost and a tough. Ah. Six. So I'm going to take three. That's annoying. You got the tough, though. Um, I have take I eight of twelve. I've taken four, so this is only worth two. Well, I guess I'll ghost kick the enchantress. Originally, I wanted to ghost kick Loki, but he got his stuff. Ready? Draw a card. And then this triggers, which is. I am confused. Okay. And my encounter, this other encounter card, and we get an acceleration token. So I gotta get tough and do 27 more points of damage because I got this is only the second Loki. Win or lose, this has been a good game. She's uh, Spider Gwen has definitely done better than Gamora, but we'll see if she can pull it off. I'm hopeful. But it is definitely skinned. Uh, where it's pretty, it's being pretty rough. Frost Giant and Beguiled. I have no allies. A natural storm, and I am currently confused, and I have no allies. I have no way to thwart this turn. That's not true, but I can only thwart a little bit. All right, first of all, I'll regenerate two. Regener uh, thwarting for one is just not really worth it. Okay. We are going to attack to knock... No. Yes, I want to knock this tough off. And I'm going to spend a power of all of us as a strength, stick to to ready, and I'm going to actually thwart to get rid of my confuse. That way, if I get a ghost kick or a flip, I'm ready to use them. And I do have a web binding. I'm going to stick this in there under George. Okay, one, two, three. Phantom flip. Okay, so I can remove my threat. Oh, but I I can't ready, that's right, because of the unnatural storm. Oh no, I can flip at the end of the turn, that's right. Um, okay, we had two threat. He's attacking me for a base three, four, a base five, wow. I cannot ready though, five. He gets an additional boost and a, he gets his tough back. All right, so he's doing six. I take three. And then I'm going to use strength, phantom flip, remove five threat. 
And I get the card draw, but I don't get the ready. And then this flips. And my oops. And my encounter card is Surge Reveal. An assault. I am going to do a web binding to stop that and draw a card. And another assault. two cards and I'll cancel that which will do one damage which will knock off his tough okay and I'm exhausted I will put this under George one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. We add two threat. He's attacking me for a base five. I'll defend for three. Seven. So I take four. So I am down nine now. So that's only worth one. One, two. Phantom flip, but I'm going to do it on the unnatural storm. So then I can ready and draw a card. Which I should have done last turn. And then discard cards on the top of the encounter deck until a minion. from him but I gotta deal with that first of all still dealing with the oh wow okay then the minions are going to engage um I'm going to defend against Luffy and so I'm taking one I'm going to do barely a scratch so I take no damage And then I take three from the Frost Giant, and I'll be defeated. Okay, well, folks, uh, oh, I have get good. That is right. I am not defeated. I am not defeated. I forgot I had good good out. Okay. So I'm an alter ego. Um, point dial, change to alter ego, remove this card from the game. I am exhausted though. But I'm not out of the game. But I effectively am. But we will get team building out, I guess. And I don't have my... Oh, and Healing Factor will kick in, of course. And I'm going to shuffle Ticket to the Multiverse back in. I think it's out. Yes. Not out of this yet, but it's looking pretty grim. I am very low on health, and I can't 
stay down for very long because that will pop one two three four five six okay we had two threat I think it's gonna pop because one two three four he's a base four five six seven yeah it's gonna pop um, give him a tough and an additional yeah so yeah he schemed for two three four five so that puts it at 11 frost giant makes it 12 Luffy makes it 14 so yep we lost oh well and I think I might have forgot to discard cards for a side scheme when I switched to the second Loki. I'm not sure. Um, which would be a loss anyways, probably. Well, we tried. Uh, we got a lot further than Gamora, I think, in either case. We almost got the second Loki. There was skidding a loss for a long time um yeah so that's it for loki i surrender to him he wins um so the next matchup will probably be pretty gruesome as well because that is going to be groot versus magneto <laughs> Oh, poor Groot. Uh, yeah. We'll see. But then after Groot would be Hawkeye and then Hulk. So Hawkeye versus Magneto, I'm not seeing too much hope for. But Hulk versus Magog, then. That could be interesting. Um, all right. Well, with that, I will see. I thank you for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe. If you like that, we've got more videos. There should be one here, one here, and you can subscribe down here. Thank you.